all the golf stuff is on this side here. Okay. You got the golf clubs? Yeah. Okay. They just follow you in there? You couldn't tell what color it was. Oh, yeah. It's a poop brown. <laughs> Okay. When you said brown, I was thinking chocolate brown. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think it's technically mocha, but it's mocha. It, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Thanks. It's right here. Cool. Uh, Is it okay if I record this? I have a little YouTube channel where you go and buy stuff. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> All the golf stuff is on this side here. Okay. And then it was uh, 175? Yeah. Okay, cool. So this, that, that, and then this is just an extra empty bag. Okay. Yeah. It has these. Oh, yeah. These are also all golf. <laughs> all golf. Oh, wow. <laughs> I think we're yeah. all the bags. <laughs> I think you're set for life for golf balls. Yeah, here's a okay, 180. So. The five is fine. I don't oh, thank yeah. you so yep. much. There's a, it. it even has tees. You can look at it. Okay, them. yeah. <laughs> Well, this one it, I closed it tight, but there's Titleist, uh haven't even been opened. I okay. Don't think. More balls, and I think in here there might be golf uh, gloves. Okay, cool. And stuff. Yeah, we can get it. You guys don't have to. <laughs> Here, let me open. I'll hold the door. confidential report you got from somebody. How to improve your golf. Oh, that's really so cool. I've never want, seen that before. Yeah. Know, never we run, like so. we're just golf junkies. We like all the weird old oh, stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Do you see this? It's even got this. Oh wow. It's got everything on. Looks it. like There's, a weapon. <laughs> these are like the golf. Uh, oh, the head more, covers. Yeah. More head covers. <laughs> There's all kinds of stuff. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. All right. Thank you. All right, folks, made it out to the golf course. That was pretty uh, interesting. We've never bought golf clubs from a storage unit before. Yeah. Kind of felt like one of our uh, favorite uh, YouTube channels, uh, Taco Stacks. He does like uh, scrap metals, flea markets, and he also buys yeah. abandoned storage units, which is pretty cool. We'll leave a link to uh, his channel in the description below. Lots of good stuff. Actually, he found a bunch of Scotty Camerons at a garage sale one, so we'll link to that video directly. <laughs> But uh, he does abandoned storage units. This was not an abandoned yeah. storage unit. The lady was right there. We bought it from. But uh, let's it's take a different a pace. <laughs> yeah, it was kind of cool. I never really uh, uh, bought a clubs like this. But yeah. let's take a look at what we got. Let's see. we got a good clubs over there. That's the ones we're gonna go out here and play with in a little bit. But uh, let's take a look at these ones. We got a full set of ladies square two golf clubs right here and the bag and everything. And I think there's a bunch of stuff in there. We'll go through that later. But also a Orlemar tri metal uh, driver. So definitely a really good uh, starter set for ladies. Oh yeah, that's crazy head cover. Yeah, it almost looks like the uh, TaylorMade Spider head cover, but it, yeah. that's a driver obviously. And this is what caught my eye in the Facebook uh, Marketplace listing. That's where we found out about this. These, the first two pictures were of these clubs on there. And then this one was like kind of hidden in the background, a Strixon staff bag, and there's no name on it, which is kind of hard to find. A lot of the staff bags will have like a touring pro or like a teaching professional's name on it. So uh, having no uh, name on there is kind of hard to find. And it's in really good condition. This one right here is kind of flaking a little bit, but this one is in really good condition. I don't think there's anything in this bag. I already looked through this one. The bag tag alone is cool. Yeah, the bag tag is super cool. And we got a, a TPC sawgrass towel to go with it. I think this is like a when you go practice uh, putting and stuff and you want to uh, hold your wedge up so the, uh, the grip doesn't get wet in the rain. We also got some clubs over here. The good clubs are over there. Those ones we're going to go play with. I don't know if I already mentioned that, but we got a zebra putter. I've never seen a zebra putter like this. Kind of like a two ball knockoff. Yeah. Yeah. But still got like the zebra lines. We'll have to let your dad try out that. He loves a zebra putter. Yeah, he's a big zebra putter fan. We got a Wilson Harmonized putter. We did a review of the uh, Wilson Harmonized wedges. And he did keep the wedge. Yeah, he kept those wedges. <laughs> uh, just remember that. But uh, Wilson Harmonized wedges are the cheapest wedges on Amazon. We kind of like those. We got a TaylorMade Burner Plus Approach Wedge. We'll see more of those here in a second. We got an Affinity. This is kind of like a two ball style putter too. And then uh, this, this has the guy's name on it. I want to show that out of uh, privacy concerns I guess but it's a I think this is like a handmade wooden putter and then his name is on the back it's kind of cool never seen that before but let's take a look at all of the good stuff over here that stuff was pretty good but this stuff is way better I think we paid a total of 
like $175 and we just gave $180 because yeah. didn't really want to deal a change or anything like that. Didn't have a $5 bill, exactly. but uh, neither did the lady. So <laughs> let's take a look at all of this stuff. I think it is a complete set from driver all the way down to, what is it? Lob wedge and then the approach wedge is over there. There's not enough slots for how many uh, Taylor made <laughs> burner plus this guy had, but we got the driver, three wood, five wood, and then we got the hybrids all the way down to the six and then the seven eight nine yeah that's a literally a full set y'all i have a uh, difficulty counting among my many weaknesses but we also have a uh, white hot xg saber tooth putter i've never actually used this putter before i like the white hot series so that should be good i think uh that's the putter that rocco mediate used for a long time might still use it but uh we got a sun mountain bag i've already gone through some of the pockets in here and this guy was definitely a golfer like me to say the least he's got his uh uh pouch right here for his cheap golf balls in case the round is going bad it is a bunch of fountain of youths 72 compression never actually seen those before but then when things are going well he's got a full pocket full of uh titleist i think this uh nxt tours and there's some pro v ones in there and then we got a uh, titleist valuables pouch a little uh, alignment aid and then let's see what we got in here oh what is it oh it's a tiger woods hat i haven't gone through these pockets yet that's really clever to always have a bag just in case, especially yeah, in the sun. Yeah, in case you, uh, your hat gets pooped on. We got a backup hat. We got uh, some suntan lotion, some cleats in there. We will head out to the golf course. We're already at the golf course, but we'll start playing. Fun, just to go through the bag. Yeah, I always kind of like doing this. We got some uh, nail polish well, I remover. I don't know what that's for. be an alignment aid. Make your own. <laughs> Make your own alignment aid. Some glucose tablets. It looks like a first aid pouch. We won't go through that anymore. But uh, let's see. I already went through that. Let's see what's in here. Nothing. A whole oh, lot of no. nothing. All right. Oh, we got a rain jacket in here. This guy was well like prepared. Covered. You're like, yeah, ready for anything. Yeah, any uh, weather, anything going on, you get pooped on, you are covered. <laughs> we got a valuables pouch here. Nothing in the valuables pouch. And then I think this is a cooler. I've seen these bags before. Yeah, that's a cooler. So pretty. Oh, it's a Strixon towel. I didn't even notice that. Yeah. That's pretty cool. We got a Strixon bag and a Strixon towel. But uh, what do you think? I'm excited to try these out. Yeah, I'm excited. Cool. This is a cool looking putter. I'm excited to try them out. We're gonna play like what four or five holes, yeah. see if we like them. Sounds good. All right, let's do. Oh, we got an orange whip too. This thing goes for like, I think it goes for like $85 yeah. used on eBay right now. So there you go. And the most important club in the bag. Yeah. Ball retriever. I guess we should check. I just assumed that these are all burners. Oh, that, <laughs> that uh, <laughs> head cover needs some uh, head and shoulders on there. It's uh, flaking pretty good. Oh, you got a tailor made burner draw. I will uh, fa fix my fate a little bit. And then, yeah, I'll just look at the shaft. Yep, that's a burner. They're all burners. We have confirmed, but uh, yeah, let's head out to the course, play a few holes. All right, first hole is 249 yards from my tees. So we're gonna play alternate shots. John's going up first with the driver. Hopefully you can get it close. Look at these tees. I'll have to use these in a, a second here. Oh but, uh, yeah. Check this out. Are those all like the unbreakable ones? I don't know. Unbreakable. <laughs> <laughs> just watched that movie the other day. All of these tees in here, well, most of these tees in here are all these Nike things. They're kind of cool. I'm yeah. super excited about yeah. that. Yeah. Actually, it's a Nike golf theme, but uh, yeah, hopefully, you can put one close to the uh, green here. Yeah. Going with the driver, cool. obviously. Yep. <laughs> That's so high. That thing went incredibly high. We kind of lost it in the clouds. It was going dead straight yeah. towards the uh, flag. It'd be a, a good opening uh, hole right there, a hole in one, a <laughs> par four. I don't, I don't think it reached though. No. It was super spinny. It went straight up in the air. Oh, it's here it is. I see it land from space. <laughs> yeah. Luckily, this thing didn't plug. It's got a bunch of mud on it, yeah. but we should be uh, okay. We'll clean that off. Winter rules here. Yes. <laughs> go with the uh, sandwich. Yep. And we'll go with the uh, saber tooth. That's right at it. Roll out. No hole in one, but we might start with a birdie. That was a good shot, Ash. <laughs> I can miss a putt with anything. <laughs> It does look pretty strange. Yeah, all right, that's your putt. So I am teeing off the next hole. I think it's like 140 yards. I'll probably go with a pitching wedge. Cool. Then the world's greatest putter. Guess we'll to, get to uh, try out that. This, uh, weird, uh, it's a sweet name though, yeah. Sabertooth. That is so high. Why am I hitting the ball so high? I have no idea. That's long. Oh. <laughs> oh, perfect. Oh, uh, I complained the entire time that that thing was in the air. I was like, why did it go so high? That's going to be super long. It's not as close as I thought it was from the tee box, but yes. definitely wasn't worth all those complaints. Also, I forgot to say that we we're playing at Pine Lakes Golf Course in Palm Coast, Florida. It's a Arnold Palmer design. 
pretty nice course. It's $20 with a cart for the twilight. But uh, yeah, Ashley's got what, about 20 feet. Yeah. It's right on a ridge though, so it could be a tricky putt, but world's scariest putter, no problem for her. Oh. Oh, that thing broke to the right. I thought it broke to the left. Me too. All right, so this is my putt again. You can go. Okay. <laughs> I'll trust you with this one. All right, you're teeing off. Next yep. hole is a par five. You going with the driver? Going with the driver. Sweet. That was high for me. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's going on. All right. I, what is that? A turkey? I think that's it a turkey. Sounds like we're at Jurassic Park. Yeah, it does. Velociraptor. <laughs> that's a new nature vlog. But I don't know what's happening. Both of our shots are just going way high today. John still has quite a long ways in. Going with the three wood. Hopefully just get me close. Well, that was about as bad as you could get. <laughs> dead straight. My like, leg locked yeah. up on the back swing. Also, please tell us what that noise is. I think it's a turkey, but that's quite terrifying. Yeah, it's a velociraptor. Yeah. <laughs> Throw some dirt down on that for sure. Yes. It's like a Sergio divot. Oh. A few feet to the right, and this would be a completely different yeah. story, but we managed to luck out. The rough stopped us from going in the bunker. We've got about 100 yards left. Ashley's going with the eight iron. We got like a bumper car, <laughs> or no, uh, bowling rails around us. Oh, that's right at it, roll up. Ah, just short. The rough kind of caught your uh, club there. Yeah. I have no idea what I was talking about with the bumpers. Bowling, what are they called? Uh, yeah, bumpers. bumpers. Yeah, yeah. yeah the, like the back of the green has a huge hill so to block it. Down. Yeah, I don't know what it was called. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's looking good. Oh, man, that thing broke us. Yeah. All right, go tap that in. Okay, not with you, that, you don't though. don't need this. <laughs> it's your super tooth, sorry. <laughs> All right, next hole is a tricky par four, a dog leg to the right. Actually, it's not that hard from the forward tees. We might be able to get it pretty close to the green now I think about it. Yeah, I'm not going. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you make this, you're not. Oh, you've, that almost lived out. I almost cheeked myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right, next hole, probably going with driver. We're gonna carry it over some houses. I think we're good. <laughs> Tiger line. Well, I unintentionally took the tiger line. I was trying to shave a little bit off of the edge there. That's and we, more aggressive. Yeah, we basically went over every single one of those houses. It must have hit that car path to get up here because that's a pretty long carry. But we got a, uh, speaking of pretty long carries, this yeah. is a very hard bunker shot. Yeah, take your bets if John's next shot is also in the bunker. Yeah, this might be a bunker bunker. A double sandy maybe, but yeah, I would take the most minimal uh, divot whatsoever. Not a normal splash shot, just like very minimal. So just like make contact with the ball? Here. Yeah. Okay. Alright, aim a little bit left. There you go. Oh, that's pretty good. Sit. There's water behind there, but I don't think it's going to reach it. No, I think it's going to be good. Alright, we're not in the sand. Not in the sand. <laughs> Excavated ourselves. <laughs> Oh. Oh. <sighs> I was just about to say we turned a uh, birdie hole into a bogey hole, but Ashley was able <laughs> to uh, tap that one in here with yeah. her uh, murder weapon. <laughs> All right, let's try and get a birdie for you guys here. Our next hole is uh, pretty similar to this one, actually. We'll go with driver. It's my shot, right? Yes. Yeah. You guys right, cool. thought we'd forgotten about it. We are going to do the giveaway winner. That's not what we forgot about, but let's see if we can creep up for today's nature vlog. Oh, let's see if we can get him. Behind the oh, no, ah! Got one more hole to find some nature for you. There's squirrels over here. Squirrels over here? Just one. Just one? He's distracted though. Oh. He could sneak up on him. No, I'll let him do his business, but yesterday we were at Daytona Beach Golf Course practicing their little short game area and four cats rolled up on us and they were just like staring at us from like 10 feet away. It yeah. was pretty cool. I was not getting a very good practice session in, but it was no. fun. <laughs> it was productive, but we got for distracted for sure. But uh, also guys, we are going to do the uh, giveaway winner for the Square Strike, Ashley's favorite club of all time because you guys sent us a bunch of stuff in the, uh, the unboxing video yeah. that we did. So here's the... Uh, Winner right there will pop Congrats. them up in the corner. Hope you love it just as much as me. Yeah. 
Do we say? Do we decide if we're gonna do the green one or the black one? The green one. I'm the sorry. Green I'm one? Kind of the green one. the black one. Yeah, the black one's pretty cool. The green is iconic. Yeah, the black one's stealthy. It's like yeah. it might be a square strike, but you don't notice it from afar. <laughs> All right, par four right here. We got to carry a bunch of bunkers. Don't think we're going over any houses. At least not on purpose. I tried to hit like a 60 yard slice and the draw by has kind of turned it into like a 10 yard fade. I also used this weird uh, Callaway tee. Not sure what the purpose of it is, but it did uh, hold the ball up while it was uh, swinging. Check. So check that. Uh, you know, I got kind of a tricky little pitch shot here. You got to go through a couple of swales. Probably want to aim like 10 feet left just to be safe. Oh, what get through that. that. <laughs> oh, it did. It bounced off that one swale and up the other one. That was a good shot. Not exactly what I was going for, but it worked. Yeah, there's no pictures on the scorecard. Just tell everybody that's what you meant to do. I'll cut out the part where I told you to aim left. Cool. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can end with the birdie. No. That was in. It hit that, the. Yeah, they hit the middle of it. You yes. still have the stuff in the uh, the hole, so I, we're gonna count that as a birdie. Show that little hole thing. Yeah, they still got the things in there. You're not allowed to take the flags out. All right, that was dead center, and I'm definitely counting it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We had a lot of fun. That was definitely a change of pace for us. We've never bought from a storage unit before, but uh, we'll see you next time. All right. Oh, I don't know why. I know. <laughs> <laughs> like, subscribe, comment, and... Do all that YouTube stuff. See you oh, next I time. I got the orange whip. Oh. We probably should have practiced with that before. before. <laughs> oh, squirrels. Oh, no. Hold on. What? Where are they oh, going? Oh, They're on. going crazy. I'm making all kinds of noises. I think that's a stash. I think those homeowners give them a stash. <laughs> bye. All right, bye. <laughs>